wrong with you back there? What? Brad, you lost your shit, like, big time. You almost killed me. What? What are you talking? Come on, no, no, come on, that's ridiculous. Well, what the fuck is going on with this ship? Because I gotta be honest, it feels like there's some, like, like, evil, like, literal evil going on down there. Let's just stay calm and relatively sane about this, okay? The stuff I saw, it's like there were these old soldiers, they were bodies, they were dead, but then they came alive and- That doesn't sound that crazy right about now. I saw something. This, uh, uh, this old lady. I mean, she was batshit crazy, like dinosaur old. Not that that's a bad thing, but she just, like, up and vanished on me. Alex wasn't the only Alex. What are you talking about? There were things walking around with his face on them. Alex's face, it, it was horrifying. Julia, I'd never hurt you. You know that, right? No, I know, it's just... Let's time out, okay? This place is too fucked up to just be fucked up. You know what I'm saying? I mean, like, something is going on here. So what do we know for sure that we can all agree on? Am I crazy or are we on a ghost ship? Like, ghost ships are real and this is one and we're totally on it and oh, holy shit, we're so totally fucked? I was gonna say the same thing. We found a note that said a bunch of guys tried to get out of guard duty because they were really freaked out by something. What do you think actually happened to this place? No idea. It looked like the newspaper was from 1947. This whole place reeks of weird. Dirty, stinky, weird. And I don't like it. It's like this place is stuck in a perpetual bad feeling machine. Did you see the gold? Anything? Manchurian gold isn't actually gold. It's a fucking chemical and it's leaking all over cargo hold too. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this isn't exactly what our friendly fishermen are expecting either. <sighs> this should go over well. We know more than we did before. That's something at least. We're wasting time. Whatever we do, we have to do it now. Time to get off this ship. We're not going anywhere without the distributor cap. The Duke needs it to run. Hold on. This ship's gotta have a radio. If we can find it and use it... That's great, but do you think it still works? Just need to find a way up there. We gotta get off this damn ship. <laughs> no shit. I think we're... Uh... Speaking clinically, totally effed. I know it sounds crazy, but maybe it was these guns that took down the plane from our dive. these if they weren't Swiss cheesed. Sadly, no, but I'll keep my eyes open. Oh, damn. Huh. Must have been moving some pretty dangerous cargo.
Hey, a little help over here. I think this is our way up. Give me a lift. Pull you up. This is... This is where I chased Conrad, before. Huh. I, I thought it looked familiar. Over here! Got a way through here. Last log shows I'm caught in a storm. Find a radio yet? No, but there's got to be a radio on this ship. There, there has to be. I'm not exactly confident about our chances of survival at this point. Something's wrong here. If you were headed to San Francisco, you'd be crazy to take this route. It's almost like they didn't want anyone to know they were coming. Like hide and seek out in the ocean. was blown off course, cloud cover was bad. They couldn't establish a position. Yeah, that's gross. Looks like this poor sucker bit it right in the middle of his message. Hmm, sounds pretty desperate. Take a look. No freaking way. This thing actually still works? Well, radio science hasn't changed much in 70 years, as long as there's power. I'll give it a whirl. Ah, it's working. It's a number station. Military bandit. 
Let's ask them for help. Hey, hey, is anyone out there hearing this? Hello? It's like old freighter. We think the name of it is the Iran Medan. Hello? Hello? Is anyone out there? Please come in. Yo, guys, check it out. This has got to lead somewhere. Maybe we can find a way to get the power back. We need to get that radio working. I think someone should wait here in case a message comes through. I gotta be honest. I don't think I'm gonna make it down there in my shape. I'll go, obviously. I can do this. I should be the one to go. Hey, little bro. What's up? I'm thinking you might deserve a promotion. How's medium bro sound? <laughs> what, are you, what are you talking about? You stepped up to the plate. Put yourself right in the line of fire. You're kind of mixing metaphors there. Not if the pitcher's a machine gun. <laughs> I'm impressed. Seriously. So what do you think? Hey, if you're sure you're up for it, I believe you got it, bro. I'm coming too. Hey, what? Julian, no. Uh, you're not always gonna be there to protect big guy. I can handle this. Trust me. Whoa, whoa. If Julia says she can handle it, she can handle it. Case closed. Okay, Julia. It's you and I. Generator. If we can get it started, we can power up the radio. Okay, we'll wait here by the radio. Here. Hey. After you. These are the lower levels of the ship. Some sort of altercation. Ten days in the brig. Wow. Must have really blown his lid to get that kind of time. Joe in sick bay?
wish I could actually, you know, enjoy this. What the hell are you talking about? Well, in any other circumstance, you know, this place would be the coolest place to explore, like, like ever. I'm gonna say no, not at all. Says the girl who couldn't wait to dive a wreck. Shut up. Jesus. Hmm. Might have been the son of somebody on board. Here, come check this out. Look, down there. Looks like the engine room. Good place to find the generator, right? Uh, the ladder's broken off here. And I, I think I can just... Wait! Uh, Are you okay? Yeah, uh, all good. Just come down. What's up? That, it, 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 it was... Wait, wait, didn't you see it? Um, hello? Okay, so, I, so I'm seeing things, but you're not. Okay, so follow my thinking here. We know this ship was carrying the Manchurian gold, but that was really some sort of hallucinogenic bioweapon developed in China during World War II. And we know that it was super unstable and leaked all over the ship. So maybe it's still here? Maybe it hasn't dispersed after 70 years, and it's having the same effect on us, you know? Paranoid hallucinations. All this crazy shit we're seeing, none of it's real. The crew was hallucinating. We know they were scared of something, and the officers thought it was just a bunch of jumpy GIs trying to get out of guard duty. This isn't a ghost ship, it's a floating bioweapon. This couldn't have anything to do with the plane wreck we dived. Okay, so the plane was a search and rescue. It came out here because the people on this ship sent a distress signal, we know that. But I guess at that point, the fog had done its damage, and for whatever reason, they shot the plane down. I mean, who knows what the hell they were thinking, or thought they saw. Oh, God. All right, let's get going. 